Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mobby. We are back with more Starbound. We are on the search to just finish this freaking quest, man. Scan objects to find floor and clues. Searching on a nice forcey planet, which they recommend. Uh, we found some more glitch dungeons, so let's go ahead and explore it today. I want to go ahead and eat something, however, because I'm freaking starving. My character is. Man, I'm a little hungry in IRL too. Actually, no, this isn't. This isn't a bad place. Look, everyone here is nice. Oh, I thought it was another glitch dungeon, but it's just a glitch um, settlement, which is good. I can just come here and grab everything I want, like the chandelier. Gimme, gimme. They're not going to say anything. And I can just, yeah, I can just take some stuff. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? How you doing, bro? I don't really care about the lore here. Just give me the items, you know? Just give me the items. Yeah, there isn't much here. Oh, there's a king. Can I talk to the king? Hello, King. Excited. I'm going to check my eel traps later. Wish me luck. Actually, no, they're robots, so they would be um, robotic British English accents. I'm going to check my eels. Wish me luck. All right? No? Is that a raises? All right, anyway. There's a lot of stuff here. Do I really want to take the time and go through every single little bit of quest? A guests in the castle codex yeah I don't really care about this I mean this doesn't really do anything yeah this isn't gonna do much for me I just want to find like a chest or something like maybe go through their their wardrobes like there's a chest right here look at that can I open this am I gonna have to dig through it I'll freaking dig through it man look I'm pooping I'm pooping it's the royal it's the royal quarters I'm pooping it all right let's see what's in this chest here you can't hide this from me, guys. You can't hide this. Secret door. What is that? A chakram. Grand masters of the chakram can catch it without losing fingers. It is a legendary item. I don't know what it is. Is it a weapon weapon? It's a weapon weapon. You throw it. It doesn't have a damage indicator on it. I don't know if this is a weapon or just for fun. But we now have it. Alright, we can try using it. I just found a legendary legendary item. Alright. Well, that's enough looting this place. This isn't our main goal. Let's get out of here. Woo! Woo! Whoa, oh, oh! I'm just me, Robin Hood. I'm just stealing stuff. I mean, what? Alright. Optimistic. Alright, anything left to steal here? <laughs> we stole a chalk room. Can I attack him? I take this! Wait, this guy seems to be following me. What's up, bro? Terrified. The universe is filled with monsters. Oh, that's enough for this place. Um, more silver. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. All right, let's try out this so-called weapon. Can I hit anything? Yeah, look at that. It does some damage. Let's try this. Um, I really wish it said some... What the hell do you want? This guy, like, won't leave me alone. Yeah, nine damage. It's not terrible. Yeah, okay, I'll use it for a little bit. I just wish it had some sort of damage um, number tied to it, because right now, I just know it does nine damage. Nothing else. <laughs> nine. 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 I mean, it's good because you don't use magic, uh, or sorry, your energy. You don't use energy to activate it. So it's, it's good in that regard. Eh, I'll, I'll hold on to it. I'm pretty sure my sword's better DPS. But then this has a little, just a little bit of range on it. So, we'll just see how it works. Yeah. I wish it was a little bit further. Yeah. Now I just feel like I'm playing Terraria and throwing chakrams around. Alright. My fault. I brought up Terraria. My bad, guys. I don't... I think I can just drop down? Okay, good. Woo! I'm surprised I didn't take any damage there. Alright, don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. I got poisoned. God dang it. Like I said, more often than not, things are going to mess with you. Alright, so I feel like we're just really almost close to the edge of the world. Um, okay, let's just assume we don't find the Florence Society. Um, my god, I'm getting like really messed up, dude. Oh, I'm so glad I went away. If we don't find a, a Florence thing, we're just going to keep going to planets because we have to. Um, just keep running around on a, a specifically foresty planets. But I also want to, because we have a lot of cotton now, I want to talk uh, to the Ursa Bear inside the um, outpost and finish up his shop so he opens up and we can purchase um, people have told me that he, you can purchase 
pickaxes from them, so I want to do that now. Okay, here we go. Alright, just let me get to the edge here. The edge of tomorrow, wondering where your heart went. There's a chest. I almost skipped over it. It's played as day. I can't really reach it. God dang it. I'm gonna have to open this. Alright, what is this? I can't touch it. Alright, there you go. We've got upgrade module, a violin, and a rope. Another upgrade module. That's really nice. That's always good to have. It's for the ship, specifically. So, I wonder if we can upgrade it now. Because that would be really cool. We can do that today. Um, I just don't know. Like, I, I, I always say, like, I want to do this and this and this. But the unknown factor is I don't know how large each individual planet is. I mean, I know. But, you know, because it, it says when you land on it. Like, right before, you can see the statistics of the planet. You can see its day and night cycle, the types of ores, etc. But, yeah, I just... I never really take into consideration. Oh, how large is the planet? Because I don't want to figure out... I don't want to math that up. How, you know, how long it will take to run across. Because maybe there will be, like, giant planets that might take 10 minutes to walk through the whole thing nonstop. Or 30 minutes, maybe even up to an hour. Yeah, this truck is fine. It's a nice, uh, it's a nice weapon to hold us over until we find an even awesomer sword. Yeah, I said an awesomer sword. All right, let's keep going. Oh my god, that was pretty cool. Okay, um, here it comes. I'm, I'm feeling it. We're, 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 we're gonna find those, those two little freaking, um, little torches I put down. We want some of this, bro? Dude, I'm a torch. I'm, I'm a freaking chakra master, dude. Bah, 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 bah. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I like it. It's okay. Oh, this, well, I don't know why it doesn't have any damage indicator. That's the only thing. That's the only thing I don't like about it. Because I can't compare it to can't compare it to weapons unless, you know, I literally smack things. I don't know if they forgot it or they just chose they weren't going to do it with this sort of weapon. Alright, just preparing to repel with my weapon out. Uh, that's it for the planet. Okay. We've made it all the way around. Now, how long did that take? Actually, I don't know because I went down in different areas. Oh, well. Okay, let's beam down back to... Oh, wait. Can't I upgrade? Um, let's see. How do I upgrade the ship with this manipulator that I have here? Do I go here? Crew. You are the only crew registered. Recruiting additional crew members may allow for missions. Maybe you have to finish a specific mission and then you unlock the ability because I don't know how to do that yet. If I can, then I just don't know where. Um, hmm... It wouldn't be here. I would assume something here. Oh well. Um, so let's go back to the Malvin Central. And let's uh, put down all of my cotton. I also want to uh, farm all that. We'll make the teddy bear. And then we're good to go. Okay, so we are like good on food. Like I mean really good on food. Look at all this. Look at all this stuff, dude. We have so much stuff. It's just getting thrown on the ground. Okay. So food-wise, food-wise. Here we go. Jeez Louise. All right. What's what's actually packed? My food is. Let's cook. Let's cook some boiled rice. Some poultry. Good stuff. I keep forgetting. You have to leave it there. God dang it. That's that's annoying, isn't it? Steaku. I have a couple, right? Ah, oh, yes. Three awesome steaks. I really love steak. Steak's nice. My God, look at that rice on the ground. Look at that rice. All right. So, uh, I just gotta drop some stuff. Cocoa seed. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to delete it. There's just two much stuff to hold on to like there really is beak seed beak seed um where's my cotton it should be here we have we have 15 cotton material i also want to be putting down cotton so let's go ahead and get rid of these i'm tired of this um do i have cotton seed though that's the thing now we have a uh, cotton fiber um the seed would be here correct cotton seed here it is cotton seed that's it that's like one of the most important things i can be using right now right Oh, it's got to be specifically on the tilled land. That's fine. Um, let's see. Watering can. Watering can. So this is good. This is good that we take a break and you head right back to the outpost. I have a lot of stuff in my inventory that I absolutely want to start selling. So <gasps> maybe we'll have enough money for a speeder bike now. Oh, my God. That would be so cool if we get enough money. All right. Um, I'm not sure if that's what I want to buy. Hmm. Anyway, this planet I'm on. Boring goo. Really boring goo. I just don't know how to upgrade my ship either. Okay. Just a little bit more. Okay, to the outpost. Uh, let's see. Put this away. 
foodie 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 okay so here we go we can craft some oh let's figure out how to craft it i don't want to mess this up where's it gonna be at it would be here right teddy bear here it is so you need uh, 20 woven fabrics which is easy let's go ahead and just specifically you know craft 20 it's one each right yeah one each so let's do that and then uh get the cotton wool we're good teddy bear to the earth's major and then we got a new shop unlocked uh, i know pickaxes but what else could it sell you know that'd be really cool um, now we need four cotton wool one two three four four times how much is it three four times three twelve okay we're good here's the teddy bear a cute decorative teddy bear so it's just decorative really all right let's go yes <laughs> okay zoom 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 all right two stop tell the shop the two stop tell the shop two stop tell the shop i'm glad it's like just right here you don't have to go too far away all right didn't this guy want something new uh tech stuff um he's busy i think there was something i need something else i needed to do here it must be in the quest thing but let's finish this one here we go nice it's even blue a hey, little dipper is happy now thank you now i can finish up opening the shop so now it's open but let me um before i open the shop let's open up this bag so what do i activate it i got one mana manipulator good oh module okay here we go look at the little guy up there he's so cute he sells copper and coal and silver pickaxes. This is 750 each. Isn't too bad. Oh, anyway, let's sell some stuff. Um, the musical instruments. I'm gonna sell them. I don't care. Hammer. This is this, this is the lightning sword which I'm using now. So we're gonna be using the lightning sword. Get rid of that. Um. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We we need to just sell the stuff. Let's be real, we're not gonna use half of this. We're gonna find even better stuff later on. Oh my god, I don't know what this sells for. Yeah, we're gonna find way better stuff later on, so we just gotta get rid of this stuff now. We can't be a hoarder. A hoarder. Sell, sell. Uh, secret door, sell. Let's get rid of the saplings. Uh, my god, we have a, a lot of like decorative things. We should start making a colony soon. And yes, you can make a colony in this game, which is awesome. Um, so pearl pre seeds. There's too much like seed seeds. I don't want that much stuff. I really don't. I just want like like one or two foods so I can like really have it organized. I don't want to just have a mishmash of tons of this stuff. I think sugar would be nice though. I'm gonna need to eat this. And uh, what's this? This is a rotten food. Gross. Oh, rotten food. Is that something I picked up, or is it something that happens when you just hold the food for too long? Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Anyway, we made 3,000 bucks. We now have 12,000. Is that enough for a speeder bike? Wait, well, what's my other quest here? Let me see. Um, side quest. 10 silver bars for this guy. And then he'll be able to perform a mid-air jump. Let's do that. I think I might have enough for it. Um, oh, anyway. No, I can just purchase 10 if I want. Let's, okay, well, let's see how expensive it would be if I were to get 10. 10 times that's 3,000 bars 3,000 bars I think I have you know what I'm gonna go home I'm gonna see how many bars of silver we can craft and then if I don't have 10 I will buy the difference so we can get a new technology for the double jump because I think that would be a really important item to have okay so it's going to be in one of these chests here this top one look I already have a bunch you yeah, have a lot already silver coal I'm gonna grab all this there we go look at that we got mana manipulators and stuff uh, there we go actually this is a module I can probably upgrade it now my module that is tech card all right I should grab this too grab this too let me fix on my inventory a little bit more I have selves chalk crams some bombs and lots of rope med kit now, like a med kit's nice, but god dang it, I have too much like medical items on me. All we need is all we all we really need is just the salves. The other ones just waste up inventory space. Um, but yeah, these are cool weapon stuff. Okay, let's go to the forge here. No, 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 this one. So let's just make all the bars. What's this upgrade? Upgrade? Upgrade the primitive furnace? You you can upgrade stuff? Oh my god, I did not realize that you can upgrade your you can upgrade your t 
tables. I did not know that. That wasn't a thing when I played a long time ago. So, really, really cool. Uh, but we don't need to do this just yet. I wanted to make some silver bars, so let's go ahead and make da -da -da two. Nice. Is that really all I could have crafted? I can make 21 freaking tungsten bars. Ooh, I'm rich with tungsten. No, seriously, though, is that all the silver? Hmm. That's fast. That is pretty fast. All right, looking at my inventory. Um, let's see. We have some silver. Look at that. We only need to spend 600. Okay, this is glass materials. Okay, looking good, looking good. I'll probably need to sell the red petal stuff. I don't really care about that. Okay, and... Okay, let's upgrade our mana manipulator by do by way of... Which one's this? This is increases... Oh, I have to do this one first. Increases deconstruction rate by 100%. Absolutely, yes. And the next one will be 16, but it'll happen eventually. Okay. Let's head back to the surface. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. Let's go learn the new tech. This is going to be awesome. Beep, 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 beep. I love it. We can just go straight over there. Okay, so it's going to be our double jump. I wish we had something to uh, negate fall damage. I'm pretty sure you get that later, though. Um, it, you know what? It might just be the next quest that we get. Okay, so silver bars. Silver bars. I have eight. I need to buy two more. One, two. Now we have enough. There you go. This guy's uh, he's, uh, has a little question mark over his head now. All right. What you got? What we got here, buddy? Excuse me. Marvelous. With these additions, the pulse jump tech is ready for testing. Come and speak to you again if you'd like to help. Well, I absolutely do want to help, but I'm gonna have to end here. You guys enjoyed, leave a like, it helps so much. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, upload a lot of daily videos. So my plans for next episode are of course doing these tech researches, and I also want to work on making a new armor set. And once we do, I want to do that dreadwing quest, because I want to be able to upgrade my ship, and I feel that might be the way to go. If not, well, we can try it out anyway. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to check out the Minecraft Epic Mod Pack series that is going on. Episode one was yesterday, today, episode two, and so on from these days forward. So that's going to be great. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.